Creativity is an addiction. Sometimes it's a good addiction. Other times it just totally takes you out of the game. And yet we keep going back to it like the addiction that it is. Unplugged because we will always say yes to creativity. Totally uncut because we all make mistakes. So turn it into a tool. This is Arrow Unplugged. I mean, we deal with it all the time, right? A strange coincidence. Things that happen that really you can't explain. But it plants itself inside your head and heart. And, and you, go, you go, well, what are we going to do with this? We want to honor it. We want to respect it. We want to activate it. But this strange coincidence was something that couldn't be predicted. How often do you get into a moment like that where it's like, whoa, hold on a second. Did that just happen? What a strange coincidence. Because over here, something else happened. Now, what makes a strange coincidence difficult to deal with is when we go looking for them and can't find them. It's like something will happen and you're going, come on, come on, come on, come on. There's always going to be an opposite here. And then it doesn't play out. So you become disappointed and you go, this is the way it was supposed to. But it didn't happen. It didn't become a strange coincidence. Hey, it's Arrow. This is The Choice. This is what I was writing while the sun was waking up on a brilliant new day. And today we're reading from November 9th, 2022. Waking up to the news this morning. Nothing political. This time it's somewhat personal. The world of music has lost Jeff Cook from the group Alabama. I've written about that band so many times in my daily writing. Especially during those opening days where this gentleman, my program director at KOYN, Lonnie Bell, he kept saying, this is going to be a big band. You got to pay attention. You got to really pay attention to this band because they're going to change the face of country music. You better pay attention and you better note where you were when you first heard them. Yeah. Coin Radio, Billings, Montana. And Lonnie was 100% right. Now, here's the strange coincidence. Only a few hours after receiving the news about Jeff Cook of the group Alabama, the broadcast legend Lonnie Bell, at the age of 98, passed away. Just hours apart. The man that led me to the group Alabama would also pass away on the same day as one of the members of Alabama. My wife shared with me a personal thought this morning. She said she could just see it. The two angels, Jeff and Lonnie, just sitting up there on a cloud, singing those infamous Alabama songs. Both voices and creative souls left huge positive marks on so many people's lives. Allow their places in our history to be forever cherished. I mean, song lyrics and talking on the radio, inside my heart, it's one and the same. Because what we do with our song lyrics and vocals is that we bring change in a positive or whatever way you interpret the message. A strange coincidence led to this group, Alabama. And only hours after we lost Jeff Cook, we lost the guy that showed me the way. I'm Errol, and that's what I was writing while the sun was waking up on a brilliant new day.